Hello everyone, back again with us. Welcome to Moto Stylist Channel. Today we will introduce the 2022 BMW R18 Cruiser. German motorcycle manufacturer BMW Motorrad has updated the look and special design options of the BMW R18 and R18 Classic Cruisers for the 2022 model year. The 2022 model will see a number of model revision steps included in the BMW Motorrad program. Models can be ordered from all BMW Motorrad partners in a new configuration from August 2021, wrote BMW Motorrad in an official release which they published in early July 2021. It's no secret that Harley-Davidson dominates the United States heavyweight touring motorcycle market. For years, Harley-Davidson has offered heavyweight, heavyweight, chrome-packed cruisers. While corporate America has almost the entire cake to itself, BMW is more focused on technologically advanced sports and adventure tourers than classic styling. BMW decided they wanted to go after HD's biggest offering and started producing some American-inspired tours of their own. The result is the BMW R18. Key features Twin front disc brake BMW Motorrad Integral ABS Adaptive Cruise Control 10.25 inch TFT display Specifications Engine slash motor 1802 cubic centimeters air slash oil cooled twin cylinder four stroke boxer Horsepower, 91 horsepower at 4,750 RPM. Torque, 116 LBFT at 3,000 RPM. Drivetrain, two chain driven cams above crank. Transmission, six speed manual. BMW's modern Explorer started life with one variant called the R18. However, for 2022, you can have it in four different versions, the base R18, R18 Classic, R18B, and R18 Transcontinental. All share the same engine and frame, although each gets a unique styling and a number of functional updates to the base model. The main rivals are the Harley-Davidson Softail and the Indian Chief Dark Horse, but buyers of all types of cruisers will find this Bavarian offering attractive. BMW Motorrad is renowned for its adventure and sport motorcycles, but this is the first time since 2005 the company has ventured into the cruiser segment. Their last cruiser came in the form of the R1200C, manufactured between 1997 and 2004. First showcased at the 2019 EICMA show in Milan, the R18 goes on sale in global markets including the U.S. and 2020. The bike is powered by a beautifully designed 1,802 cubic centimeters two-cylinder boxer engine. This is the largest BMW boxer engine capacity to date. The 1.8 liter engine makes 91 horsepower at 4,750 RPM, while 116 LBFT of torque starts at 3,000 RPM. What's more, this engine can produce 95% of its peak torque from just 2,000 RPM. For power transmission duties, a six-speed gearbox does the job. It also gets an open drive shaft like its ancestor, the BMW R5 from 1936. That said, number 1930's performance. BMW claims the R18 can hit 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 4.8 seconds and will keep pulling until it reaches a top speed of 112 miles per hour. However, these figures are for the standard version. The larger R18B and R18 Transcontinental will be slightly slower than that. For 2022 BMW R18 versions available. The four versions of the R18 share the same frame, but because they are intended for different riding styles, they differ from each other in terms of features, equipment, and suspension geometry. Let's start with the standard R18 first. It gets telescopic front forks and steel swing arms with central shock absorbers. The wheel size is 19 inches at the front and 16 inches at the rear. 
the wheelbase is 68.1 inches and the seat height is 27.2 inches. The steering head angle is 57.3 degrees. The R18 weighs 761 pounds, no payload. Next up, we have the R18 Classic. The touring-friendly standard version of the R18, the Classic derivative gets a large windscreen, smaller 16-inch front wheels, LED headlights, and saddlebags over the regular model. It also gets cruise control as a standard feature. Compared to the R18, the Classic seats are slightly taller at 28 inches, while also being heavier, 805 pounds. For 2022, BMW is adding two new versions to its R18 lineup in the form of the R18 B Bagger and the R18 Transcontinental Touring Model. Both models share the same engine as the standard R18, but come with many visual and functional updates. For starters, the R18B and Transcontinental come with a large handlebar mounted fairing, Marshall sound system, 10.25 inch color screen, and larger 6.3 gallon fuel tank versus revised, the wheelbase is now shorter, 66.7 inches, while the rake angle is now reduced to 27.3 degrees compared to 32.7 degrees. The R18B, 877 pounds, and Transcontinental, 941 pounds, are also significantly heavier than the standard R18. There are some differences between the R18B and the Transcontinental as well. The latter gets a taller screen, heated seats, additional lights, a top case and passenger backrest, and a running board in place of foot pegs. Standard features on both versions include heated clutches, dynamic cruise control, DCC, keyless ignition, and adaptive cornering lights. Active cruise control is available as an optional add-on. The four versions of the R18 come with three driving modes, namely rain, rock, and roll. Other features include a traction control system, ride-by-wire throttle, and dual-channel ABS. Additionally, the R18B and Transcontinental are equipped with MSR or engine drag torque control, reverse assist, and hill start control as standard. If you're a fan of Harley's big, heavy bikes and very sophisticated BMW technology, then you're going to love the R18. BMW Motorrad offers four different versions of the R18, all of which share the same engine performance but differ in terms of accessories, weight, and some minor modifications to accommodate the weight. We decided to review the largest, heaviest, and most complete version of the R18.